Hi, good afternoon. Oh, sorry, good morning. This is a first for me. What do you mean a first for you? Trying this. Oh. I'm going to try and make breakfast burritos ahead of time. So I'm going to make them and then let them cool and then I have a um, meal seal thingy and I'm going to seal them and freeze them. <laughs> meal seal thingy. Well, you know what I mean. Okay. Welcome so. to Sudlow's Kitchen. We've got some Ooh. butter to melt. Melting butter. We also already mixed the eggs. Just mm -hmm. eggs, a little milk, a little seasoning in there. Um, oh, chive. Gotta get some chive. Hang on. Oh, gotta get some chive. Oh, where is my chive? It should be in there. What did I put over here? Nope, I got it. All right, so the butter's melting, and then I'm just gonna throw the eggs in. Throw the eggs. Now these are farm fresh eggs. Farm fresh eggs from our daughter. Thank you. Farm fresh eggs. You hear that? You hear that butter? butter? You hear the butter? But the buzzer sizzling. Yeah. Okay. So got the eggs in there. Now I'm just gonna let it sit for a few so it, you know. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Uh, you, can, uh, you can put whatever. I'm gonna use bacon, eggs, cheese, and bacon. You can put sausage, you can put bacon, you could put potato, cook the potato first. You could do onion, whatever you want in your breakfast burrito. We're just going to do eggs and bacon. It's pre-cooked bacon, by the way. It is pre-cooked bacon. Right there. I have to cut it up. So, see, we start to, and then I'm just going to kind of like go like this. Not yet. You know, the lighting's very bad. Is that? <laughs> Didn't help. Oh, that helped. Time. Yeah, did it? It's a little gloomy out today. Sun comes out, then the sun goes in, then the sun comes out. Oh, there's the kid. Hi, kid. He's, he's watching. What's he watching? Oh. Eggs aren't doing much. No, why not? It's lit, right? Yeah, it's lit. Maybe it's a lot, that's why. Uh, I'm sure it is, but... We yeah. used how many? Oh, wow. A dozen? Oh, there it goes, see? There it goes. There it goes. Starting. You can see it on the flipper. See it on the so flipper. So, what I'm gonna do... What are you gonna do, Nina? I'm gonna throw some chive. Oh, sorry, I don't. I don't think I got that. Can you do that again? I'm gonna throw some chives. chives. There you go. Gotta give it flavor. So why aren't you using fresh chives? Um, cause I didn't go out and cut them. Oh, okay. Okay, so I can see the egg is coming up. See? Oh, see? Look at that. Now, I've, we've done a dozen eggs. I don't know how many burritos this will make, but we'll find out. We will find out. Sure did. Yeah. Isn't this relaxing? Yeah, the eggs are swimming in a pool. We could have done this on the flat top, but... We could have, yes. But we're going to make dinner on the flat top, so... Which will be another video. Look at that. See, See how it's all... You just swish it around. Swish. Swish. You sure you added enough butter? Yeah. Yeah, 
can't see. It's not sticking. Oh, it's not sticking. As long as it's not sticking, we're good. So now what I'm going to do, see we're getting it all mixed in together here. Okay. I'm going to throw some cheese. Now, again, you put in whatever kind of cheese you like. And what kind of cheese are we using? Cheddar. Gourmet three cheese blend. Cheddar. Mm. I like cheddar. Throw some on top like this so we can mix it in there. You put as much or as little as you like. This is this is all to you, what you like. How you want to eat it. So now we'll do this and let the cheese melt in there. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That smells good. It does smell good. It does smell good. You could do like um a Mexican style burrito. You can put chorizo in there. I don't, not a fan, but you can put salsa in here. You can put tomato, whatever. This is all to your liking. Is it? It is. It is. Look how nice and fluffy this is. <laughs> they they do they do look fluffy. Look at this. The zoom. Zoom in. Zoom out. And then don't forget, you're going to warm these up once you take them out of the freezer. Or if you want to, I wouldn't store them in the fridge for more than a day if you're not going to eat, you know. I will freeze them. And just like a, a regular frozen burrito in the store, you know? Yeah. Warm it up for a couple minutes and... Mm -hmm. Throw a little more cheese on there. And then I'm gonna throw... You can throw a little more chives. A little more chive in there. Why are you whispering? I like chive. Okay. So I'm gonna turn this on low real quick. If I can't. And then, you just chill. I'm going to take my pre cooked bacon. And I'm going to chop some up. Bite sized pieces. Yes. You can also make your own bacon as well. Yo, oh, of course, because you can make it as crispy or as uncrispy as you like. Think that's gonna be enough? No, that was only two pieces. Oh. We're gonna go a few more. And now the pre-cooked bacon. Okay, so you throw it in the microwave for like seconds. But I'm not going to do that because I'm going to just throw it right in here. Because again, you're going to warm these up. When you warm it up, the bacon should crisp up. Okay, so let's see. Let's take this bacon and I'm just going to throw it in oh, here. Oh, yeah, that's good. Up like yay. Oh yeah. Okay, we're good. We're gonna turn the pan off now, okay? Okay, pan is off. Now we can assemble. I need to wash my hands. Okay. Assemble. I'm sorry, I wasn't recording what? We have our shell. Okay, we got the shell. Then I'm going to put some egg mixture in here. More. Oh, yes. I just, you know. Why don't you bring the pan over? I don't have anything to put it on. Thank you. 
Okay. I think that's enough. We're going to see. So. Smells good. Then you roll it. Right. Like this. Am I correct? Yeah, tuck it in. Tuck it in. Like yay. But how do I get it to stick? Put a toothpick in it. Oh yeah, that's healthy. <laughs> okay, well, I don't know. You uh, pan fry it. That's what I'm, okay, so that's what we'll do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make them. Try not to overfill them. Overfill it, it's okay. expert we know burrito maker okay so we got seven we've got eight so we're gonna test this one out you mean try mm -hmm. so you can probably get eight out of a dozen eggs seven eight depends how much you fill them to Right. What I want to do, though, is hang on. scrape out my pan. Try this one. What I'm going to do is maybe squirt it with some. Do ya butter in there? A little dab will do ya. Yeah, and then I'm gonna try squirt some butter. Turn it up. I'm sure you don't want these to go too long because. Right, right. Let's see. Ooh, hear that sizzle. <laughs> At least we got a sizzle this time. True. I think, yeah, if you do this, I'm noticing that when you fold it, it will, um, it will stay then. As they're cooling off, it's, it's staying closed. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good. It's not much brown. No, I get a little browner. I was just checking it, but it flipped on me. It flipped. There you go. Got a little brown on there. Just check them. Check them. There, look at that. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, that one does too. See? 
Let them get a little brown like that. Take them out. Then we're going to let them cool completely before we put them to store. But we're going to try the one that we... Oh, yes. We're going to try one. Oh, look at this. Mm, look at that. Let me flip it on the dish. Beautiful. Beauty. See, look at these. How beautiful they are. Okay, look at that. This is the one we're going to try. Yeah, set that off to the side. Okay. Slap a little more butter in there. Now it's cooking. Using just a little bit of spray butter comes in handy. Since the pan is so hot, the color's gonna just maybe brown a little faster. See? Beautiful. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Mmm, that's delicious when it does that. It's a puffer. Is it? It's a puffer one. It's a puffer one. Look at this. And there you have. There you have. Burrito. Make ahead breakfast burrito. Just like in the store, frozen. Look at that. Look at that. Oops. Sorry guys, there was a little bit of an error and it didn't get our taste test. It was delicious. Three of us tried it, three of us loved it. That was your video for the day. We'll be back maybe later on for dinner. Have a great day and subscribe to Zudlow's Kitchen. Thank you. Bye.